fine. Just uh, needed a breather. Sounded like you blew your guts airlock. Yeah, I barfed. It's just stress. Esa chamba te va a matar. Yeah, maybe I should have gotten a safe one, like you did. Hey, at least I always know who's shooting at me. Sometimes even why. Anyway, what's going on? Is there a problem? <clears throat> we had a leak. My boss called. Dragged me in because we had to intervene. Everyone at Night City HQ is on edge. But no way you're fucked, right? You're the one who fixes other people's shit. Jackie, if you work in our soccer counter intel, you're always fucked. Listen, gotta go. Work won't do itself. Buena suerte. Supposed to be here an hour ago. Guerrilla was heavily involved in the business his father had founded. Fucking Frankfurt. That Abernathy bitch will probably dump it in our laps. Ugh, hanging up. I'll be in my office. You hurry up. His career was abruptly interrupted by war upon his doorstep. Saburo Arasaka enlisted as a pilot in the Nippon Kaigun, the Japanese Imperial Navy. By the age of 23, he had already achieved the rank of. Mr. Hey, v. Emergency Vinny. protocols active. System security confirmed. I see you're busy. We'll talk later. What do you think they're doing now? They need to mop up the leak. The company could lose a boatload. Please enter the antechamber. Visitor authorization granted. Are you online? Have a seat, V. Be right with you. We have to handle this voting issue before we lose our bases in the Sea of Clouds. They're about to begin. What's the situation? Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, just as we thought. You know what to do. Start now. Director Abernathy. I watched the vote. What the hell was that? A deep clean after the shit Frankfurt dumped on us. As we agreed, I got rid of the problem. I told you to resolve the problem, not massacre the European Space Council. Do you understand what the cover-up will cost? We would have lost the license. Now we gained a week. That's a win. Path of least resistance always. No nuance has you written all over it. We're not done talking about this. I hate that bitch. I always have. Always, meaning how long? Before Night City, we worked on an assignment in Osaka. Two years of subterfuge. She spent them digging a trap for me. When she became director of Spec Ops. And that's when she finally shoved me in it. And now she's holding a gun to my head to make sure I don't try anything. But she won't pull the trigger because she needs me. I do what she doesn't have the guts to do. Divide and conquer. Effective strategy. <laughs> Effective. What would you do in my position? You have to defend yourself. Remind Abernathy you're not her doormat. You're right. Smack her once, but hard. She'll respect you. 
Seems we see eye to eye on this issue. Take this. It's what I've collected over the past weeks. Biometrics, trauma team card, names of her closest associates. Driver, chief of security, lover, lover's husband, everything. Use it and make sure Abernathy won't be a problem anymore. You said it, I need to defend myself. happen if I refuse don't ask stupid questions this isn't a request V we seem to understand each other take this too use this money only find the right people for the job no corporate affiliation and for the core task use someone you know inside out are we clear yeah I think we're clear good in that case I'll await your report, and good luck with it. I have my AV waiting outside. It's yours to use. And don't disappoint me. Jenkins, Night City Counter. I have those reports you asked for? I don't have the time to send them my way. Nothing to add. Tell your people to be careful. No. Hey, say anything you alive? No. I'll stink to the viper bee. No, they won't forget. How many times do I have to say it? Need your help, Jack. Got some biz. Uh, always biz with you, Mano. You in some trouble? Not yet. Right now, I just need a soul I can trust. That kind of sounded like a yes. Meet me at Lizzie's. Be there in an hour. I need your stamp on something. It's possible one of our assets was exposed. Well, if you're in a hurry, I completely understand. on the boat? I mean, shit. Access granted. Please provide your destination. Destination, Lizzie's Bar. Noted. En route. Scheduled to connect till the end of the week. 
Quantified Satori received notification of a somewhat troubling biometric reading. I felt I should call. Is everything in order? Things are dandy. Everything is. Just think back to our last session. The neuromotor relaxation exercises three times a day, they'll soothe and lift your spirit. I know this. Sure, okay. See you later. Find a spot close to the bar, as close as you can. Fuck procedures. Initiating landing sequence based on new parameters. Problem, psycho suit. This look like a landing pad to you. Could have fucking crushed us. Jesus Christ. Oh, okay, no, no, hey, we, we ain't looking for no beef with you. Seems trouble wants in. I don't want any trouble. Just here on business. Good to hear. Welcome to Lizzie's. Now come here often, do ya? <laughs> it's good to see you, cabron. Now sit down and tell me what's got your shorts in a knife. It's good to see you too, Jack. How you been? I got sparks flying between the Valentino boys and Maelstrom. Eddie's there for the taking, as long as you don't get flatlined. And you know how it is. Can't complain, but we ain't here to shoot the shit about me. Let me hear about this problem of yours. Jackie, before I start, this stays between us. Por supuesto. I'm serious. This thing, it could ruin me. So could I. You do realize who you're talking to, right? The guy who's done this before. Remember what happened in Mexico, at the border? I peep one word. I know, you saved my ass. I've worried about the cartels that gotten out. But it didn't. And this won't either. That's why you came to see dear old Jackie. Data shard. Take it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What do you think? Won't come cheap. It'll have to be done on the sly. No trail. Hard eddies only. Got the money. Full crew job for sure. Techie. Maybe two. A runner with a gold-plated brain. And a driver with wheels from hell. Not to mention, a solo. Huh. The piece I'm missing. That what you need from me? My trigger finger to zero this lady? Thought I could always count on you, Jack. Well, <laughs> you know me. I'm not all sunshine and rainbows, but... This job ain't my style. Actually, I didn't think it was yours either. You know how Arasaka operates. Okay, maybe you don't. This isn't a professional request I can refuse. But I can. And I am. And you should too. Now, what do you say we lick her up and talk life? Gracias, mamita. Double tequila with grenadine and lime. Nothing better for drowning nerves. 
to this. Was that a toast? The hell does that even mean? You raise a glass to your mama, your hermana, to the mamacita you'll meet at the bar, but this doesn't say a damn thing. <sighs> to this. This job and all the rest of that corpo bullshit. You know what it is? Un pacto con el diablo. Been saying it all along. Soldiers sold to those Arisaka fuckers. Today, they got you to zero somebody. Tomorrow, they'll get somebody else to zero you. Think I have a choice? If I refuse, they take everything and leave me nothing. Now well, let them. They'll also take the fist they got gripping your balls. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty picky about who I let touch my balls. And Saburo and his matones? Oh, they definitely do not make the cut. Maybe someday. But for now, I'm still well within their reach. You'll always be within reach. Always re Hey, you lost? Got a problem? V, is that right? You're from Arasaka HQ. Is there a problem? Are you here about Frankfurt? We're here for you. Jenkins assigned you a task today. You'll share all the details with us. Name and department again? Didn't quite catch it first time around. Gah, fuck! How you feeling? Pretty sharp dive, huh? Your access to company networks is hereby revoked. In two minutes, any company cybernetics in your possession will cease functioning. Give us the data you received from Jenkins. This will conclude termination procedures. How the hell did you find out? That is not your concern. The data, now. Information's on the shard. Smart choice. Formalities? Yes. But I think Abernathy would gladly up our fee for ridding her of a piece of rot like you. Stand up! You're coming with us! Come on, move Fire it! Spinning. I think you fellas might have forgotten just how far from home you are. I'm not sure this body was your style, let alone a healthy option. Get out, claro. Is that a threat? Well, you start shooting, maybe we join in, huh? Before you know it, somebody might die today. We have what we came for. It'll do for now. Ooh, dodged one there. V, how you feel? You all right? Like... Like shit. My throat's like sandpaper. I'm not sure I can breathe. It's like when my little primito was ditching drugs. Nasty chills. Trembling hands. Cold sweat and dry even. Y yeah. Sounds about right. Hey. Hey. Should I get you to a ripper? Or, I guess... Maybe drama team's on its way. Give me a minute. Get my shit together. That... That'd be that, Jack. Just lost control of my life. Completely. I'd say you got it back. You couldn't say no to him. So they said it to you. This is a turn for the better. You'll see. Besides, you haven't lost everything. About to say I still have a friend? That's sweet. <laughs> no, dumbass. You still got that wad for the hit job, don't you? Probably some fat ass chunk of cha chain. Just right for a new start. That's right, fool. Buckle up. Hey, you hearing all right? V! V! Ah! Hey, hermano. 
Your new life, it starts now. Hello there, Night City! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams! Ooh, I love this town! Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her! Every new day here means a hundred new arrivals! But only half these gongs will survive a year! And that's if it's a good one! And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Blackhand, and Waylon Boa Boa! The greater the risk, the bigger the party, kids! Or so they say! But you can only be a major league player for so long! The faster you live, the faster you burn out! If you don't get a bullet to the brain first! These legends know where you'll find most of them. The graveyard. It matters not where you're from. Matters not where you start. What matters here is the walk you walk. In Night City. The city of dreams. chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open, all right? Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Sure. Why the hell not? Let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your reflexes. The skills you gain here will help you survive, even excel on the battlefield. I will train you to be effective with firearms, to use stealth tactics to your advantage, and to hack into enemy networks. Because App Militech... Man, Militech can't encrypt for shit. But they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Now, Station One, you maggot! Move, move, move! Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm-up. Yeah, I didn't think you'd find that too tough. What do you say we crank it up a notch? Not bad. But it's more realistic if the target's packing. Quit standing around and take cover! Oh. You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, huh, look. We brought some tunes with him this time. You know what to do, V. Scream work, V. Stand on the platform and we'll move on. Hacking's the next item on the menu. Might notice I tweaked the course material.
This training module will teach you how to apply technological... Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. Crash. Style over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. Never smart to leave behind any trace of your handiwork. Especially the dead kind. Now pick up the body and hide it somewhere. Okay. Now, try to take him down in one slick move. Think you're ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Have fun! Now, detonate the grenade. See? Just needed to shut your brain down and follow orders. In true Militech fashion. Not too shabby. Militech's algorithms put you on a decent run. Got additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Or you finish up, dealt out now. But remember, the street's not gonna give you any hints or second chances. Well, we doing this? Right, so first, let's shape up those stealth skills. Find cover, quick! <laughs> nice, nice! Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. Stealthy now, V. You ever relive a ninja BD? Just like that. Thank <laughs> you. 
Nova, well done. On to the next area. Now the same thing, only with the camera. Back to your training, recruit. Nice work today. Just stand on the platform to exit the center. All right, some advanced combat techniques for dessert. Then we wrap this party up. Time to get down and dirty in close quarter combat. Let's bump things up from easy to normal. This next fool can block your attacks. Dull bit coming up now. Block and blows instead of dealing. Oh. Oh. Mm. Ah. Ah. Now this fool loses his footing every time he swings. Use that. Get in there and land a counter punch. Want to see this fool? Punch in air next. Don't let him land anything. Ah! You've done well in mastering the way of the fool, young apprentice. I can teach you no more. This is the part where you face your final test. Move on to melee weapons. Grab a sword.
Good. Now show me what you've learned. Good stuff. Looks like you're cruising already. Hop on the platform. Good luck, V. So? Not bad, huh? Now we can get down to biz. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Looking for 1237. Target should be inside, but I got zero eyes on her biomod. Fingers crossed it's not too late. Is that you? Oh, I hate this life or death shit. Hurry. Try hacking the door. Think you can trip it on your own, V? Sandra Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corporal Immunity. V, Nita, eyes up. Then the hell's ahead. Drop him quiet, V. Careful now. Nice. Couldn't have done that better myself. More bodies ain't coming. They're almost on you. These fucking creepers. Why ain't me? They're coming. Wait for your chance. Pick the prick off. Score big on that prima scrope she's got.
sensors. Looks like you got them. You're clear to go. Shit, where the hell's our target? Look around. You gotta be there somewhere. Jesus fucking Christ. Think I got her. Got our target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomon. Need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. This does not look good. Sandra Dorset, NC570442, Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neural cord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Found the shard. We're moving now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon claims trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Oh, fuck! She's flatlining! B, need to know what's going on. Jackie, air hypo! Fuck, this is bad! Hey, catch, vato! I think... Holy shit, it worked. Fuera, cabron. Get her outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace. T133 to control. Patient NC570442 secured. Stimulus being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 fibrinogen. Let's get out of here. Elevator gets us to the garage direct. Good work. Shit show's over. Cutting my wires now. See you in the near future. Listen, Mano. I got this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Hmm. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the metro. How's it gonna look for me? Won't leave you hanging, Jack. 
but don't get used to it. You're saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Oh, almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. She's alive and well. That's what we agreed, isn't it? Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Words out the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. If I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight, we better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Mano. I'm driving. Night city. city like any other, just bigger. No, mano, not just any other city. Morgan Blackhand, Andrew Whelan, Adam Smasher. Legends are born here. I'm starving. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, they're locking down Watson, remember? Oh shit, you're right. Is it just me or... Oh, I know it. Man on her ass, tailing us. Hello. I don't like this. Not what that you did. Scarf! Hijo de puta! Fucking drive, Jackie! Come on, V! Can't keep her steady! Holy fuck! Mierda! Perdón! Got you, asshole! V! Aim for the driver! Chingado! <sighs> Scratched your baby up pretty bad. Sorry, V. It's okay. We can wait. Let's just focus on getting home. Damn. They're pulling out all the stops. What does the lockdown to further notice? Necessary security measure. Officer, ma'am! Damn, are we ever lucky we ran into you. Really? What's it that makes me so special? A uh, heart of gold? Because only somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh-huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand-up guy. She's giving me a chance. Waiting. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe. But he's a good kid. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. Hey, I 
too focused on your image Pitch your life behind these bars But you can't live out so your So you can be nice when you feel like it When am I not nice? Uh, always? I'm always never not nice Ain't your average badges. That's Backstack. NCPD's Apex Predators. MTAC rolls in when things fly out of hand. Gonk's out there, though. Just a bit day snack for him. Well, show's over. Poor bastards. But they had it coming. Made it. Almost at your place. What about you? Not likely to make it back to Haywood now. Kill V? They'll let me through. Sure about that? Oh yeah. I'll play nice Jackie again. Sweet dreams, then. Tell Misty I said hi. I will. Hi, luego. Good evening, Night City. My first guest tonight is the bug. Forgot earlier. A runner I know has something you could probably use. Zip in your deets. Praise be to thee, our Father in Heaven. And our second guest is Karina Lee, host of the Chip End program, which promotes the use of cybernetic implants. How's luck treating you, beautiful? Can't complain, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. Now, I'd like to... Oh, stupid gates busted again. Third time. In a word, if you could. In one word? I'd say immortality. Immortality? Really? something when I jacked into that corpo's biomon. Dunno, uh, neurovirus, sir. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throw some threads, meet me downstairs.
At NUS bases, President Myers has openly blamed the Republic of Texas for the attacks. Hello, it's time for you. Hey, V. Regina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, V. Musical performances by Biwa Virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation. And in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNSU. So. Man of the hour. <laughs> Sheesh. Took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. I mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens. I think I might have bagged us a sweet-ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but... Just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated cool. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Oh, really? No. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half-baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure, you crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias a Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. First stop, Ripper Duck and Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. For the record, it's gorgeous, but that many I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date. The MSD. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know. Bruce finished him off. Gonna stretch it out over the whole round. Yeah, this is it. Come on, V. Find me once fixed on dust in your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex is going to do. What are you, checking them out? 
Hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. Yeah? When you get those kind of tunes? From way back. Doesn't matter. Then what happened? Fucking hell! Ugh. The drops his guard. Uh, you can... sort of Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. while. What do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean. Hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later. With interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time. You hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now check in. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay 
see that Major League arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Same as always. Don't feel a thing. You ask me that every time, you know? Not as if things are gonna be any different today. Sure thing, kid. I mean, not like there's any risk of a stroke or paralysis, but <laughs> what do I know? I'm just a doctor. That's what I thought. Lights out for a minute, all right? Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust, but first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also injected an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. Chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk us up. ¿Qué onda? Hey, how well you know Bug exactly? La mamita got a soft spot for me. <laughs> no, but seriously. V, listen. I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? 
Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. <laughs> Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. No, no problem. Just a death sentence. NC's Arasaka's turf. Nobody fucks with them here. What can I say, Mr. V? High risk, high reward. First rule of the afterlife. Besides that, I'm no leadhead. Ain't gonna leave no trace for them to follow cause we gonna do this clean and on the hush-hush. We understand each other. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Cause if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, cause Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this ship's crew, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Quiet life 
or a blaze of glory. Hmm? Later now. Dexter, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally and not, yeah. Clem to want to check our pro cred. But to me, it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the Gangoons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> Ching on. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. Must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Let's do a way go. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up! Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. Transport fuck up's toxic for you, I know. So listen carefully. You and me are gonna meet. See if we can't find a way to help each other out. Mutual self interest. Agreed. First exit off Skyline, driving towards the NID. Storm Channel under the overpass. Meet you there.
Look lively. Meredith Stout. Take it you were the one to call? That'd be me. Thought you could blackmail me, fucker! Set conditions! Got any more for me? Christ, Meredith! Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly, are you here alone? I asked if you came alone. Got guardian angels with 50 caliber snipes aimed at your skull. You don't let me go. Your dogs will have to glue you back together. He's lying. Try that again, and it's two million volts. Got it? Do a sweep, now. Now listen, Clues. This piece of shit, Anthony Gilchrist. Is he your contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... Ugh. Him you can let go. Wanna hear what he has to say? I need a bot. Flathead mob. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment. So I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Is that the kind of subtlety they teach at Militech? Chip spiked with a virus, clearly. That is true. Something goes wrong, I'm the one they'll fill full of holes, not you. Time you were straight with me. What's on there? A tracing algorithm. Latches on to financial streams. Nothing you need to worry your head about. <laughs> nah. No what, Stout? My offer just came off the table. Mistake. Big mistake. Stop, you bitch! You're done! You're fucking done! You and everyone under your thumb! You hear that, fella? Straight to biz, eh, Mano? All right, all right, all right. <sighs> Don't know you. Want to talk to Royce? Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Place. 
Could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Yeah, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots of dead meat. Get in the elevator! Fucking shit! You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. Called him special. All right, keep chill, V. Remember, we're on their turf. So what do you want? You got a bot. Model MT0D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch. Planet. I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. See your ass down for a planet bullet in your skull. Jesus, Jack, what gives? Primerito? I don't like this guy's tone. Segundo? Sitting on your ass makes you an easy target. See your ass down for a planet Jack, bullet in your skull. Sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well... All right. Come on. Got lighten up. Take a hit. Thanks. I'm good. Whatever you say, straight-edged princess. Here we go. The flathead. Model MT-0 D-12. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too, so when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm Could lose your lunch. So what you think? It'll have to do. <laughs> Look at that. Let's see your cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. Huh. I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Asked you a quick. Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. Big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun! The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> yes, sir. So you're gonna consider my offer now? Ha! <sighs> now that's good business sense. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seems you already got the eddies for it. You ought to offer us a discount. Big one. A discount? Fuck. 
You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshawn. That's who. Dexter Deshawn. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> he ain't dead? <laughs> nope. He's alive, well, and kicking. He sends his regards. So you gonna consider my offer now? Grab the gear. Bottom control shard. Quick! Gotta find a way out of here. We've got the set. Bot and control. Then let's go. Quicker the better. Get out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air. I fail on his feet. Ah, I can taste it. It's a production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way.
You'd never see me again, didn't you? Naive little punk. We don't want any more trouble. No, I seriously doubt you do. Today was about Royce getting his just desserts. Couldn't have done it without you. Flathead's yours. And consider us even. I want a perimeter. Secure the area. Time we were on our way, Kanan. Holy shit, V. I wasn't sure we'd walk out in one piece. Thanks, Jack. Solid as ever. Hey, yeah, you too, but, uh... Hey, what's this about? You feeling all right? Yeah, I want to make sure, you know? We're good together. I like how we do things. I do too, V. I do too. Hey, let Dex know we got his toy for him. And then I say we hit the afterlife. <laughs> you know, do some shots. Hay luego, V.
How things looking, Mr. V? Uh, Mr. V? Got the bot. And how'd it go? Run into any trouble? And what about the Militech angle? Sure, of course there was trouble. Royce couldn't have given two shits that you and Brick had shaken on him. How'd you get him on board? You used the corporal woman? I met Stout. And? Didn't exactly hit it off. Poor Meredith. No doubt in my mind she'll be left picking up the tab after your bad day. So how'd you get that cat Royce to hand over the flathead? Only way I know that always works. Brute force. You got some balls, Mr. B. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Mm -hmm. That meet's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Parker will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. Looking a little put out there, Input. Interest you in a preem, BD? Sure. In I go. Hold it. House rules first. There will be severe penalties for any unauthorized recording. No drugs, no groping. Someone catch your eye? You do not grab them. You find them in the catalog, ask for a BD, and get yourself a box. I really look that green to you. Like I don't know. Mm-hmm. Doors open. Have fun. Ma, but what a sweet welcome to Lizzie. Face you have. Where do you go? Yeah, no surprise there. Oh, the pen's on you. Maybe you Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here? Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a, uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm Mateo. Uh-huh. So, Evelyn? Club's big. We're gonna have to look around. Can't do it for you. It's all right, Mateo. I was waiting for this one. Evelyn Parker. 
I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello sooner? I wanted to get a good look at you first. Mind if we talk about the job? Heard you got something for me. Mm. But not here. Come with me. We'll be in the lounge, Mateo. Anyone asks, we're not here. So, what can a Nothing's wrong. girl like me really? do for a hunt? Why don't you just tell me the truth? Elmer I Lee just told you. Sprinkles? Fucking okay, here. Whack. Maybe I'll Dex had a load to say about you. Called you professional, effective, and trustworthy. I hope he wasn't overselling. Let's talk biz. I mean, it's nice, but I didn't come here to get my ego stroked. No, you're here to gain some knowledge. The life-changing kind. Well, now you got me all excited. Your target. I trust you know what it is. Relic. Secure your soul trinket. Key tech in the program, actually. We're tangling with Arasaka, making this heist one dangerous, risky motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Arasaka's poured billions into personality transfer technology. But me, I just want the data on this one. The chip is tucked away inside Compeki Plaza, the hotel. You ever been? Classy Corp hotels? Yeah, no. Out of my price range. Hmm. Other decors to die for. As you'll see for yourself. So where's this chip hiding, exactly? In a suite on the top floor. The room's occupied by Yorinobu Arasaka. Yorinobu Arasaka? In Night City? <laughs> Guess the scream sheets weren't lying this time. It's on the lips of everyone in the city. Saburo Arasaka's only surviving son, heir apparent to the Arasaka Empire, in town. Please. Could it be? Emperor's prepared to cede his throne after 150 years? <laughs> Doubt it. Only a handful of people in Night City know what the Arasaka's real plans are. Tell me you're one of them? Look, if you've got any spare aces up your sleeve, now's the time to show them. Now this should make your prick perk up. Yorinobu recently swiped the chip from an Arasaka laboratory. He's made a deal with Netwatch. Aims to sell it to them. Have you spotted my ace yet, or do I need to spell things out? Fine. So no Arasaka security on the device, because Yorinobu whisked it away in secret. Now, where's he hiding it? Well, likely in a specialized container. One that mimics an organic neural environment. On the outside, it looks like an ordinary briefcase. And the case is... You'll see for yourself soon enough. Provided we're done gossiping about the Arasakas. Okay, what's next? Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. <laughs> Think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits? Jacking off to in those boxes? No. no. It can be a very useful tool. Good for Relax. analyzing details, human perception, even boosted, doesn't grasp. No, exactly don't what you need. Cry. You've got so what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? It's supposed to be Yorinobu's pad on the tape. Means you were inside. You know each other? How else could I get all this intel? I know him pretty well, actually. We have an arrangement. Strictly business. Suits us both, I think. Let's see this brain dance. Judy'll help. She's a mox too. 
Besides, we go back, uh, years. V, this is important. Judy's always been there for me. Always helped out. I trust her. But she's a mox, not the latest member of your crew. Try not to forget. So, you'll be a good boy, tread lightly, and keep that tongue on a leash. Relax. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. <clears throat> hey, there you are. This is V. He's here for that BD role. And V, this is Judy. Best brain dance editor I know. Enough already. You're gonna make me barf. Impressive looking setup. Need all this to process brain dances. Mm-hmm. Analyzers, sensory SIG amps, acoustic and emotive wave monitors, facial expression translators. <clears throat> Judy. All right, all right. Compiled your BDF. What do you think? Will it do? Still pretty raw. But yeah, ought to do. Mm-hmm. V needs to get deep inside. That's most important. So, let's calibrate. Tune it to him. Believe me, I've dealt with worse. Should see the jig-jig street porn we gotta contend with sometimes. So, we drop V inside. Let him look, let him rummage around, right? How about it, V? Raw brain dance. Ever taken a dip before? Look, I'm no beady virgin, but the raw stuff? Uncharted territory. Relax. I'll explain everything. It's less complicated than it sounds. Sit down. Settle in, and we'll get you going. Gotta create your sensory profile first. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Gonna run the analysis soft. Should feel a slight tingling. Mm-hmm. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly what BD analysis is capable of. One more sec. Need to get the pain receptor limiters in. Okay. All set. I need to test your profile first. Tossing in a sample BD. You can use it to get to know the editor. Now let me see, where could we... Can't he just use my recording? Why are we wasting time? So we don't risk our necks? Sides won't take a sec. We got something here. Should be perfect. Boot it up. Mm-hmm. Let me give you the tailored version first. Let you get your bearings. Then we'll jump into editing mode. Be diving in and... Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Everybody! On the ground! I want to see you kissing the flooring! Money! Now! Or I will fucking drop you! I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Uh, uh. Now! Before I blow your fucking head off! Ah! 
slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That flash of intense shock. I can still feel it, I remember. Fuck, that last second. You could have warned me how much it hurts to die. Trust me, real death hurts much, much more. Not so sure about that. You'll be fine. Got everything set up? Let's switch over to editing mode. I'll sever the link to the BD Roller's sensory array. You'll be able to look around freely. Whole scene's yours. Full cam control in analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback. Can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor console Plans to unpause. Try it. Nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind, yeah, I, I, roll it back to the top. All good, neat. Now try fast forwarding a bit. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't be creative. Okay. You can also reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of by the BD roller. Focus on the heat, the gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Plants, simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. You go in, snap it. Yeah. Tell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And rem remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Let's move on. Now heads up. In analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got closer. This tech records everything. Every little detail. Even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Okay, fuck! On you go! Ah, little shitheads! Go restock. I'll take the register. How about you suck a bag of dicks, eh? Hey? So, any thoughts? Unbelievable. Seriously. Like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw. Stuff the roller's cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. <laughs> Hello, nice. Now let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. Down! Everybody! On the ground! You wanna see you kissing the flooring? Money! Scanning works on peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. All right, next thing. Scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. 
Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Surveillance cam. Must have caught our shooter. You'll see in a sec. Cam feeds to the screen behind the clerk. Roll back to where the screen's in the kid's field of vision. Then scan it. His own Chumba shot him. Probably planned to all along. Must have got a nice slice of cred on the black market for a BD like this. BD freaks are ready to pay a preem for a real flatline. Anyway, if you've seen enough, you can exit. Yeah, it's impressive, right? It's too bad most of the BDs we do here are only good for flogging the log. Anyway, you ready to do this? Look at your wreck? Dunno, I... Let's take a break. Still feel like that kid when... <sighs> yeah. I think I'm done. V, there's no time. Get it together, please. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Just need T-Bug to link in. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Who? Running for my crew, security specialist. She'll tell me what to look for while we analyze. No problem, I hope. Actually, it is a problem. Not what we agreed, Ev. Judy, T-Bug's a professional, discreet to a fault. You can trust her. Why? Cause you say so? Please, Judy. I'd never expose you to any danger. You know that. Call T-Bug and we'll dive in. Hey V, what's happening? Bug, listen. I got some useful footage from Compecky Plaza. It's a brain dance. Compecky? Oh, thought as much. Someone there with you? Unimportant, T-Bug. Please focus. Need your help. Got no clue what I'm supposed to look for once I'm in. All right, see if I can walk you through it. Jacking into your tech now. Mm, you've got to give me access. Opening port 1779. Secure protocol? Good, I'm going in. Should be getting my request... now. Got it. You ready? I'm Milisec. Okay, connection confirmed. Now some quick tip ice, and we're clear. Ready to dance. Fire her up, Judy. All right, V. Eyes open. Gotta find out where Yurinobu's keeping the relic. You look like a cop. But a fuckable meat, are you? Evelyn. She... I felt her fear. Sure got it under control quick, too. I said, no! They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But, uh... Make it. Here in a drone... Ventilation and cooling? Servers. Gotta be. Fancy doodads in here need to be controlled. Self-comfortable. I need a minute. Listen in on that conversation, V. Could be something important. Finish. 
We shall see soon enough. My father's a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's involved. a tired, visionless old greybeard who thinks nothing will change and he'll live forever. In his tiny, frozen bubble. I should not even be listening to such things. You will listen to this. Saburo is an adult despot, utterly removed from reality. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Of a world that may never have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. I am quite sure we want now. Read the documentation carefully. The relic requires specific storage conditions. You must no. provide them. In Heard that? Relic docks gotta be around here somewhere. Look for them. Old Greybeard who thinks nothing will change. He will live forever. I said no. They'll have my head for this. Then, you shall perish for a good cause. But uh, Make yourself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's taken a particular interest in this project. He can certainly explain the risks. My father's a tired, visual old radio. But there's nothing will change. He's like, oh, no. Stuck in some fossilized vision of a world that no longer exists. Ever have existed. We have not seen eye to eye for the past 20 years. We cannot survive them. Sorry, Mr. Wade. Just do it. Is everything all right? You seem tense. Angie. A moment. It will pass. Hmm. I can get to work on that. Just one condition. You wish to make demands of me. Only one. Focus. Got any candy left? Stuff was pretty fun last time. Bedroom. Nightstand. I've got an idea. Be right back. Very nice. But come here already. Just a sec. Looking for the perfect thing. Ah. Uh, You'll like that. Loaded. Safety's on. 
Good to know, though. Once you're in there, don't forget about that iron. What love is Until you learn the meaning of the Manual details a special tip controlled container. Relic needs to be kept real cool. So, chip's gotta stay in the freezer. Yep, could damage it otherwise. Okay, switch on thermal layer detection in the editor. Should be easier to spot where you are know who's keeping the chip. Geez. Looks like Mr. Arasaka had something to celebrate. Really think you'll find the chip in there? No way. Tim's too low. Could fluctuate. Nice try, though. Myself comfortable. I need a minute to finish. The program is still in the trial phase. We cannot take it to market as is. We shall see soon enough. Please speak with your father. He's dead. Right, grab the heat sig. Matches the spec in the docks. Yorinobu's got the case here, guaranteed. Mm-hmm, we got it. Good work. Looks like we got everything we need. Quit out of the editor. Get everything you need? <sighs> yep, that'll do. Thanks, Judy. We got it. Later, T-Bug. Nice work today. See you soon. I'll wipe the cash on your data. You were never here. Keep it. I'll put it on Ev's tab. Portable device for handling BDs. I already uploaded your calibration settings. Not as sophisticated as what we got here, but should do the trick. And it keeps you out of harm's way. Clever. Speaking of harm's way, know what I see looking at you? Walking, talking corpses. Relax, I got it all under control. If you fuck up and they come knocking on my door, Judy, relax. Not gonna happen. Evelyn, please. No shortcuts. You go that route, City will always win. So be careful. Of course I will be. Besides, we'll talk in a bit. V, let's walk. Well, what do you think? So, what now? V, do this job for me. 
I mean me alone. No splitting the payout with anyone else. No middlemen. No decks. No fucking way. Dex took a leap with me. He trusts me. Now I'm doing the same. 50%. With cred like that in your account, you won't need Dex for anything. No, Evelyn. It's not just about the money. I thought you were a merc. I thought it was always about the money. Not behind the back of someone who trusts me. Sorry. Fine. I never asked. But V? Hmm? I just hope you're as good as you are naive. If you need me, call. I'll send you my number. Okay. Good luck. Now go. I need a few words with How things looking, Mr. V? Turns out Evelyn's recording from Compeki was worth our time. 4 a.m. last night. Beautiful. T-Bug already called. Said she's working her magic. We're all set. Ready to go. What now? Now we do the job I hired you to do. Grabbing that biochip. We'll talk about the rest at the afterlife. See you there. Great. Be there in no time. See you, Mr. V. Maul, hey, got a little problem. Ma, Plank. what a sweet little face you have. Que ya tengo planes para esta noche. Ven, Santísima Ma. Te vas a enterar mañana. Yo también te quiero, Ma. Yeah, about time, Holmes. Looks like you just ran a marathon. Did something happen? Let's do this! Years of murk work, and yet still sweat like a roasted pig when I talk to my Ma. Can't help yourself, you know? Checking to see if I'm not rotting in some dumpster. Like most of the Wells boys, it's really starting to wear on me. The more I tell her everything's okay, the more I feel like I'm straight up lying. But that's done after tomorrow. After life, here we come, baby. <laughs> yeah! We're only here because Dex is pulling the strings. Doubt that puts us in the same league as them. Oh, but we are. They just don't know it yet. Ready to get your cherry popped? Yeah, come on! Place used to be a morgue. You believe that? Who would have thunk? I know, right? Way before our time, that. When proper burials were still a thing. 
uranium mine plant. But occurred just outside Nova Sibirsk in southern. And who might you clowns be?